Good day and welcome to this GIS report. I am Communications Officer Colleen Penn. It is official. The DS200 tabulator and the ePoll books are on island and we'll be utilizing them for the first time in our general elections. Today I'm joined by the Supervisor of Elections and Ms. Penn, how do you feel now that you see them, the, 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 the instruments are here? What are your thoughts? What, are your, what is your reaction? I am excited that they are here. Um, we've waited for this moment for a long time and now we are finally, 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 finally here. Great. Now, I know there's a training that's happening right now as we speak. Tell us about that training exercise that's going on. Um, presently, we have the returning officers and the technicians being trained at, with regards to the EPOL books. Later on, we're going to take them to be trained on the, to, with the DS tabulator as well. Cool. Right now, they are being trained as we speak with regards to the e-poll books. And I'm glad you're doing this. This is to make them get more familiar, I guess, with the poll books in advance of the election. Yes, this, is, this, this training will be ongoing. This is just the first of many trainings that's going to happen. Within the next week, we will have the returning officers, the poll clerks, the presiding officers, the technicians, um, the staff from the elections office, and we'll also, during that training period, we'll also have the general public, the, um, the candidates, and as a matter of fact, the whole entire BVI being trained to use the machines. That's great. I see your office have a very strategic plan moving forward to make sure yes. everyone gets familiar before the e upcoming election. And why is this important? It's important so that persons are not afraid. They, um, they know how know that the machine is not some not something to be fed. It's just it's just to make life simpler, to make the elections process um, better and more efficient. Thank you so much, Supervisor, and all the best to you and your team as we continue this education process. Public, you'll be hearing much more from us as we speak about the 2019 general elections and all the preparations the Office of the Supervisor of Elections is making in advance of the election.